Hey guys, so today is Friday, day three of my uh, daily vlogs for the year. Um, uh, anyway, today I'm uh, up here back at school. Uh, like I said uh, yesterday to uh, get my immunization uh, history. So, uh, yeah, I came here early enough this time. Uh, so, I was able to get a copy of it. And, um, uh, let's see. The vlog for today is... Well, you're going to um, be seeing this tomorrow anyway, but... Okay, so... Oh, hold on, let me just reword that then. The vlog for yesterday... Because I have to think ahead now, huh? Uh, vlog from yesterday was uh, uh, rather late, I know that. Um, uh, in fact, actually right now in the present, I still have to um, edit that vlog. Um, I actually got up a little... Oh, what the hell? Um, late today, because uh, as you know, um, uh, Thursday night, um, my uh, friends had uh, taken me out to uh, this really expensive restaurant um, uh, for my birthday, and uh, the main goal, well, one of their goals, were to get me incredibly hammered which they succeeded thank you very much guys um... Oh man. Uh, but as you can see I am perfectly fine at the moment uh... completely hangover free mostly um... it's kind of funny how I am, uh, got over it too cause like um... uh... well there are tons of um, tricks to um, get over um, this uh, problem, right? Like some people do what is it called the uh, prairie oyster or something like that? It's like a raw egg with Worcestershire sauce and some celery, pepper or something like that on it. Um, for me, it's a cup of ramen. Weird, huh? Um, I mean, the first time I uh, discovered that uh, a cup of ramen actually works for me, uh, I don't remember how long ago it was, but I was um, uh, not feeling that well that day uh, after a night of heavy drinking. Uh, and I know that uh, for nausea, um, saltines uh, seem to work. So, uh, unfortunately, eh, I had no saltines in my house at the time, uh, but then I thought about it. It's like, what is salt? What are saltines? They're just crackers with salt on them. And then when you um, think about a cup of ramen, because at this time, uh, one, I needed a um, uh, fluid in my body because I was just completely dehydrated. But every time I tried to take in water, bleh. It all comes back out, right? So that was problem number one. Problem number two. I know I definitely need to eat something, get some nutrients back into my body. Again, yeah. And I figured, okay, saltines. Those should work, uh, right? Because those uh, help with nausea and stuff like that. So, um, but I had no saltines in the house. What I did have were cups of ramen. And when you look at the uh, cup of ramen when it's still in its dehydrated state, it, the the noodles are basically crackers. And since uh, uh, these um, ramen cups are so heavily salted, it's like uh, when you make a cup of them, it's like you're going to be eating so uh, soggy saltines. So. There, there was my solution, or at least that was what I was hypothesizing at the time, would be my solution. I would get fluid back into my body, I would get some nutrients into my body, and at the same time I would also be uh, taking care of the uh, nausea. Um, funny enough, I ate that bowl, um, cup of ramen, and uh, I was completely fine afterwards. So, uh, and uh, since then, that's pretty much what I uh, use uh, 
to uh, get better. This is weird, right? I mean, and I'm pretty sure it's not going to work for everyone. This is just something that works for me, uh, personally. Um, uh, I mean, if you guys have any uh, your own uh, like little uh, weird things that I'm um, uh, actually help with your own uh, uh, hangovers, please comment down below and let me know. Uh, I might like to give those a shot uh, sometime in the future because I can't always have a cup of ramen uh, on hand like uh, last night when I was um, uh, back in my uh, friend's dorm because uh, I was definitely in no shape to uh, drive. And uh, so, uh, but the entire night was just miserable. Couldn't really sleep, and nausea was still bothering me the entire night. And so, <sighs> anyway, um, okay, this is something I uh, meant to talk about yesterday, but uh, didn't. Uh, for the past two weeks, I have been trying something, a supplement called uh, raspberry ketones. Um, I'm pretty sure you've heard about it by now, or maybe it's uh, it's uh, been on the Dr. Oz show quite a bit and it's been all the rage uh lately um i know my uh, uh our store uh, it's been selling them like crazy so and it's like the after the very first episode that uh, Dr. Oz talked about raspberry ketones everyone kept on coming into our store calling into our store uh, asking do you have raspberry ketones do you have raspberry ketones we ordered them on uh, from our the, um, uh, the manufacturers. They were all like two or three weeks back ordered because everyone wanted them. I'm, uh, it's like, I mean, there's a joke at our store that everything that Dr. Oz says is gold, and uh, we haven't been proven wrong yet. Uh, anyway, I've been trying it for the past uh, two weeks because. I just wasn't uh, convinced that um, that these uh, raspberry ketones are in fact that effective. Uh, and so uh, I got a bottle, and I decided that this is going to be like a little experiment. The control here is that one, I am not going to uh, change um, uh, my uh, eating habits. Two, not going to change my activity. Uh, the activities I already do right and three just uh, take the uh, uh, supplements as instructed each day and uh, so yeah no change to my lifestyle whatsoever the, the only thing that's being test uh, the only variable here is the um, uh, the amount of yeah, I guess so. Yeah, um, the only variables here are the ketones and the weight. So um, after the first week, I uh, lost about um, maybe four pounds. But at that point, I still wasn't convinced, and I figured, okay, this must just be normal uh, weight fluctuation. So um, not convinced. After this week, I'm now up to seven pounds off. Still not convinced. It could still be just my normal weight fluctuations. Okay, so uh, after um, the uh, 30 days are up, um, I'll pass a final judgment then. It's like I told my friends about them uh, this also, but I'm not going to recommend uh, raspberry ketones to anyone until I have finished the bottle and uh, know that I'm not going to be uh, recommending junk okay so uh, uh, there's that and uh, I guess that's it for this week what am I at 10 minutes now hmm. uh, or close to it Alright, well, that's it for this week then. No. I'm saying this week as if I'm still doing the weekly vlogs. That's it for today. And I'll be making day four tomorrow. Because that's how daily vlogs work.
Obviously. Alright, see ya.